Okay, hi, this is Ken Dreesen with uh, Local Ideas, and we're working with the Energy Bootlegger again today. Uh, I called it the Energy Bootlegger because I thought that it would probably be against the law to build such a structure without, you know, um, several master bader degrees and doctorates and all that kind of stuff. And uh, lo and behold, that's not true. You can have a boiler that is a hobby boiler or a historical boiler and there are statutes in the state of Wisconsin <coughs> under the Department of Commerce and if you have a boiler that's less than five cubic feet and operating pressure less than 250 it's exempt from the testing per Commerce section 41.181F. And also uh, in the statutes, if under 41.181D, if your boiler is for agricultural purposes, it is also exempt from inspection. But uh, now what we're going to do is look at some of the tests that they do for boilers in order to make sure they're safe. There's a hydrostatic pressure test that would need to be done if your boiler has to be inspected. And in that test, you're supposed to run or pressurize the boiler at 1.25 times the pressure of the safety relief valve. And my safety relief valve on it well, I had to take it off to get the pressure, but here's the here's the relief valve, and it's uh, 150 pounds. So, um, oh, that would be what? So then I'd have to test that at 187 or or something like that. Um, but anyway, this boiler does a lot more than that. Um, I'm going to show you right now. What I got here is. Uh, this is a hydraulic grease gun and I have that hooked up and I have the boiler sealed all off and filled right to the top with water so that it can't compress because it, it's a hydraulic, it's a sealed hydraulic unit and you can't really see it right now very good but this, it already has a hundred pounds of pressure in it just sitting here right now and it's holding that fine. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put it, the camera on the gauge and I'm going to pump it up further and I'm planning on pumping up to 500 pounds because I know I can take, I know it's going to take that and that's way above what is needed to run this boiler at 100 pounds which I want to do to generate electricity. Okay. Okay, I'm going to pump away here. Okay, we got 400. Oh, it's getting a little harder to press now. Whew. Okay, we got almost 600 pounds in there. We're gonna make it a. Uh, there. There. That's a uh, five. That's about 600 pounds pressure. Right there. Check this out. I zoom in here so you can see. See, it's 400 is down there. It's between 500 and, and 800 pounds pressure. Whew. Okay. <clears throat> 